welcome back uh, today we have a new problem uh, problem number 18 for sum um, given an array called nums of n integers return an array of all unique uh, quartables num of a and num of b and num of c and num of d such that uh, a does equal a and b and c and d uh, bigger than uh, uh, yeah bigger than or equal to zero and smaller than n was in the length and um, a and b and c and d are distinct and we should have nums of a and nums of b and nums of c and nums of d are equals to target so we should find four numbers that will add up to the target sum so let's start from there so first we we can return in any order as you can see here we have the target equal zero so we return all of this like minus two and minus one plus one plus two it will equal zero fold oh, this also will equal add up to zero and this will also add up to zero and we want to make sure that all of them are quite unique so there is multiple ways to solve this one um there is two ways come to my mind one is to use a two pointer with um with a recursive uh, solution which will be quite easy and tough in the same time like basically we try to uh, to create a function that will work on, on 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 the way that we try to call the function like for example we want the force sum so first we be in the first element and we try to call uh, another function on the second element and whenever we have another two we can we can just get these two and these two and just add them together so let, let, let's see how we can do this one um so uh let's just create um let's sort the array first you want to all the time sort the array specifically in the sum any sum situation because it helps you a lot and makes the looping way more easier and we want to return a function we will call it k sum um it will be equals nums and we add target and we uh, we start from zero and we want to add the get the four k sums and i'll carry i will create here a function let k sum which will equals a function um nums and target and start and k which the amount of nums that we should search for and i will say const res will equals empty array and uh, rest it will be all the all the the, 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 the responsible array that we return so and we return the rest after all and we have here um I want to put some piece cases because we are doing a recursive function. So, so first, if start uh, equals nums dot length, that means we have a, a piece case. So return uh, res. Also, I will say um, const average value, which will equal uh, target divide by k. And in this average value, we'll do some other piece case. So basically, if the nums of start because since we sorted the array in ascending order if nums of start if the first element which is the smallest element is bigger than the average value or the average value is bigger than the last element We return the uh, the rest array also. Mm. 
um, if k equals to 2, we uh, return a function called twosome. And we send to it uh, the nums array and the target array, and the target value and the start. We start from it. And we have. If you don't understand anything right now, just 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 be patient. I will I will describe everything. Lit. We have lit here, and we have a, um, a two sum, two sum, which will equal the function. And this function will have nums and target and start. And let's just leave it right now and continue upstairs. And um, right now I will loop through the array. I less than nums dot length and I plus plus. I'll say if I equals start or nums of i minus one doesn't equals nums of i because we want to make sure that everything is unique if that was the case we will first we have uh y y y We will have a, a, a subset first, const subset, which will equals uh, will equals the key of uh, sum. <coughs> we will try to get the sum of the remaining values, and we support target, and the target will equals minus nums of i, because it's not equals all the time i. And we put the starter to be from the next position, so i plus 1, and the k will be minus 1 because we want the, the remaining, for example, 3 or 2. And I will say um, for const of, so const uh, um, lm of. Uh, subset we we try to uh, risk the push nums nums of i and also we will add to it all everything in the subset okay and um, it's important also to look at the two sum here. We will have here uh, const res, which will equal an empty array. And we will have low, which will be start. Let. And we will have high, which will be in the end. And we'll try to make a while loop. I guess it to, it's, it's trying to get harder and harder, but just be aware with me. I while loop low and um, it's when while low is smaller than high. And I would say, okay, uh, so const uh, the current sum will equals nums of low plus nums of high and if the current sum smaller than target or 
uh, low is bigger than start and nums of low equals nums of low minus one because we want everything unique uh, low plus plus else if the current sum is bigger than the target so that means we need to take one or high uh, is uh, smaller than nums of i minus one nums dot length minus one and nums of hi um, and nums of hi equals um, nums of hi plus one yeah and uh, that means we need to take one because we want everything to be unique so minus minus high if this is doesn't happen that means they equals each other so rest the push nums of low and uh, low and also i will add uh, i'll make low plus plus and also i will push nums of high and i'll make it minus minus and i will return rest okay 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 just easy let's just uh, try to submit and see if it work or not uh, yeah what Do we have high here? What is high? If current sum, oh. um, the solution is not right. What's going on? Why? Oh, sorry. Um, oh, still. Uh, wait a minute. There's something wrong with my code. What was it? What was it? Let's just try to think. Uh, const of sub const element of subset and we have nums of i and everything an element subset equals k nums target minus nums of i i plus one and k minus one everything looks fine to me if i equals start and nums of i minus one that equals all nums of i What's going on? Why it's not working? I, I don't know why it's not working, but let's just try to copy the code directly and try to describe everything. Maybe I did something wrong. I don't know. Let me, let me, let me try to delete the code and just try to... And I just run. Okay, it worked. Okay, let's just try to describe what happened here. So first we have the for sum. The for sum function takes an array of integers called nums and integer target as an input and returns a list of unique uh, uh, quadruples uh, in nums that add up to the target sum. Okay, first we sold the nums. 
we do this first we sold the nums array in ascending order using nums.sort to uh, prepare for efficient searching after that we will return the key sum so the key sum function is helper function that recursively finds the key elements in nums that sum up to the target and it returns a list of containing these key elements um first if there are no more numbers to consider for example here we have no more number to uh, to consider uh, uh, start is uh, at the end of the array the function returns the risk element okay other than that if um, if uh, there are no more uh, if uh, first we calculate the average value which represents the minimum average value needed for the sum to reach the target so if the smallest value in the nums is greater than the average value or the average value is greater than the largest value of the sum it's impossible to obtain any sum target so we uh, so we return an empty result okay let's start here if the smallest value in nums uh, sorry if 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 k is 2 it calls the to sum function to find the pairs of the element that sum up to the target. Okay, if the key, uh, uh, if um, in the loop, in this loop, as you can see this loop, in the loop, it iterates the true elements in nums. If the current element is in the same as the previous one, it's skipped to avoid duplicate results. For each unique element, it recursively calls uh, ksum within k minus one and target minus uh, uh, nums and to combine the current element nums of i with each subset of k minus one elements to obtain from the recursive call. Okay, this is, this is important. This is the hardest line to understand. So basically. Um, finally, we return res resulting of the key element combines combinations. The two sum function, this one here, the two sum function takes an array of integers, nums, at a, and a target and start index as uh, as input and returns pairs of uh, elements that sum up to the target. And it uses a two pointer approach. To find the pairs efficiently so if uh, the function initialize the two pointer we have low and high here and um, we uh, we calculate the current sum of the elements indicates low and high if the current sum is less than the target or if the low pointer is not as uh, the starting index of the current element at the low is the same as the previous one it increments low if the current if and otherwise if the current is bigger than uh, the target and the high or the high uh, current high is the name as brief as we decrement the high and otherwise we have find we have we found a new a new a new pair so we push so basically what we're doing in the function we try to find the targets and until we find k is two we till the, the the two of k and we have two already before so let's just try to find here so if you try to find one here so you have one one and minus one and zero so basically let, let, let's take this as an example so it will be easier for us to understand okay so here you start you have nums you have target and the start it will be zero and uh yeah and the start will equal zero and the k will equal four And since we're starting like that, let's just continue. You have start will equal zero. Uh, so this is, no, this is not true because the length is like six. And um, the average value, it will be a uh, uh, target by k. Anything by zero is zero. So if nums, uh, w and we, we try to sort this one. So let's just sort it. It will be, um, mm, Minus two, minus one, zero, zero, and one, and one, zero, zero, and one, and two, right? One and two, yeah. 
so basically let's just throw it if the nums of thought bigger than average this is uh, not true it's smaller and if the end is smaller than average no the end is bigger than average so this is not true so if the k is equal to 2k equals to 4 so we continue we have a if i equals start right now i equals start so we, we try we call the subset directly again of the k of sum and we take uh, uh and, and and the target will equals target minus uh, uh, uh nums and plus i so we have this one the target will equals uh, this one and you try to find the the the, the, the other values so physically you will find uh, the nums of two you will continue to find something that will add up to zero and you will find for for this one minus one and minus uh, minus two minus one and you have one and two two zero will not be added and so on so forth so that's it for this video and i hope you like my description if you like my content make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll never miss a video and see you in future problems